Hi, folks. It's Andrew, Top Fitness Strategies. Yes, another video, and I have the headsets on today because uh, uh, I'm, uh, I'm experimenting with something behind the scenes, so don't let that distract you and everything. Okay, today what we're going to talk about is a little bit of positivity going on. Uh, and I bring this up because uh, in, in one of my notes over here, wherever you can see, if you can see the camera, um, and uh, I, I just, I, what I do throughout the day is I write things down that uh, I want to talk about later on. And so I have a whole notebook full of quotes, phrases, paragraphs, words, what have you, that I can always just go back on and say, okay, I want to talk about this one day, or this is going to trigger something in my mind, or something of that sort. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I, and I want it to always relate, um, for the time being at least, to the fitness industry, especially the fitness over 50 industry. And uh, um, so today I wanted to bring up a little bit of positiveness or positivity, if you will, because when you look around uh, TV, um, certain radio, certain um, activities going on in, in the world and things of that sort, it's negative, 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 negative. And uh, as much as it's part of, a part of our lives, uh, I, I hate watching the local news uh, because if, if, if you, um, how do I want to phrase this? I'm not saying it's good or bad and different. I'm just saying, me personally, it's it's not a, a, a positive, uplifting thing for me. Because watch it, uh, watch your local news wherever that where is wh whatever that may be, with six o'clock, ten o'clock, eleven o'clock, whatever. What time your news comes on your local news? Look at the first two or three stories. Um, you got death. You got um, emergencies. You got um, bad weather. You have things of that sort. It's not uplifting and uh, when you think about it do you really need that in your life I don't know maybe you do maybe you don't I personally prefer not to have all that negativity in my life but that's part of it it's there so what you need to do or what I choose to do and I'm gonna uh, um, tell you to do the same thing is have a little bit of positivity going on in your life as well so the, the, one of the ways to do that is to think back in your past uh, whether it's Two days, two years, 20 years, 25, 30 years, what have you, especially when this relates to the fitness industry. That's, if you've worked out in the past, think about what you were doing and when, when you were in the best shape of your life, or you feel like you're in the best shape of your life. It, it could have been high school sports, maybe college sports, maybe after sports and things of that sort. Maybe it was in the gym, maybe it was on the track, maybe it was on a bicycle, what have you. But think of the positive stuff. And I'm not saying to think about it so you can duplicate it, because let's face it, I've talked about, uh, uh, I've talked about this quite a bit in the past. Life gets in the way. Um, you might have been able to spend a two or three hours a day at the gym, at the track, on the bike, what have you, in the water, what have you, um, 25 years ago, 30 years ago. But maybe it's just not feasible for you right now, or maybe you just plain don't want to right now. But that does not mean you can't think of the positive stuff. How did you used to look? What did you used to feel like? And at least for me, there's several times where I was I was combining um, uh, 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 running with weightlifting. Then I was, uh, I, was, I, was, I was in a biking mode for, for a while. I was riding bikes like, like crazy. I felt good about stuff like that. There's uh, certain instances that I can remember uh, running on the track. Uh, it was an old cinder track I used to run on. It was great. Uh, different times I can remember being in the gym, uh, lifting with my buddies. That was always fun. It's a positive, uplifting thing, and, and it keeps me working out wanting to improve myself. Not to get back to where I was in yesteryear, but to get better than what I am today. Doing something workout-wise, it's going to help me advance to a, to, a, to a better me physically. And, and that's all I'm asking you to do is for a five-minute span every day, sit in a corner, sit on a couch, drive your car, turn the radio off, turn off all distractions, what have you, and think about something in your past that you did physically that put you in a, in, in a good spot, that you really, really, really enjoyed the way you felt and looked and everything else. And now next time you go to a workout, whether that be a, a quick yoga section, a quick yoga session, <laughs> whoo, say that one fast, uh, or a, uh, a, 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 weight, a weight thing, 
running, bike, uh, swimming, what have you. Next time you go to think about that, uh, the next time you go to do that stuff, think about how you were in the past and how that made you feel. It gives you a little bit of inspiration. And plus, it puts positivity back in your mind. Make sense? God, I sure hope so. Hey, while you're here, look below, subscribe to the YouTube channel um, so you can get updates uh, of when I do these updates. You can get updates when I do the updates. And also while you're there, go to topfitnessstrategies.com. Look at the link. Uh, click on the link. Go there and get on the Q&A newsletter. It's a weekly newsletter I put out. It's uh, all about Q&A. Uh, I answer questions uh, that you provide to me you know, in the way that only uh, that myself and Top Fitness Strategies can do. It's a real fun newsletter. It comes in your email, no problem whatsoever. It's, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's fun, inspirational. You'll love it. I, I, I guarantee it. So that's it for now. I will stop it. And uh, hopefully uh, um, you understand that positivity, just bring a little bit of positive into your life. You can do this yourself. And uh, we'll go from there. Okay, so until next time, this is Andrew, Top Fitness Strategies. Ciao.